Welcome back to Cardigan Bay Fish Adventures. As the title suggests, I'm going to show you the difference between a bullus, which is in this hand, and a dogfish in this hand. Keep watching and we'll go through the subtle differences to tell them apart. Starting off with the bullus, which is in this hand here. The nasal flaps are pointy, the heads are more broad, and they generally look a bit more aggressive, I suppose that's the only way I can really put it, as you can see there. They look different. Dogfish is pretty flat and smooth on the nose. If you look side on, there's no nasal flaps there really. It's pretty flat. Side by side, you can see the difference. And forward on the front. This is a bullus, this one is a dogfish. Also, another telltale sign, which is very difficult to tell by. You've got, that's the anal fin, right there. And you've got the fin here, which I'm not sure of the name of it. But it starts sooner, that fin does, compared to the end of that there. If you look at them both, side by side, the dogfish one starts later and finishes later. The bullus one starts sooner and finishes sooner. So if I put those fins in line, you can see the difference where they're starting and finishing. Another thing I can show you with these, this one's a female and this one's a male. This one is a female, as we can see there, there's nothing at all. The male has two claspers, just like this dogfish here. So side by side, as you can see, this one's smooth, female, this one's got claspers, a male. So yeah, there is your differences. These are actually alive and being very well behaved, but I'm not holding them tight. So yeah, there's the side profile, as you can see. The front profile, and that profile right there, so you can see the difference. I hope this video helps you out, I'm going to get these back in the water, but yeah, share this video and also save the video, maybe even download it. A lot of people do get these mixed up, um, it's very very difficult to tell the subtle differences unless you've got them like this, side by side. Side by side, it's easy to tell. Another thing with these you've got to be careful of. The skin on these is smooth, smoothish that way. But when you come this way, it's rough as anything. I'll put it down by my microphone and listen. Hopefully you can hear that. It's rough as anything going that way. The best way to hold these, don't be rough, get the tail and bring it up to the head. It doesn't hurt them and hold it with your thumb. Sort of like that, so they're in a curl shape. What they'll tend to do is wrap around your arm and give you like a Chinese burn, but it, this is like really rough, it rips you apart. So yeah, you bring the tail up to there and you hold them there and they will eventually relax. But to be fair, this is being really well behaved. It really honestly is, so. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped you out. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't lose the video. So you'll always know the difference between your dogfish and your bullus. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.